Welcome to the Crazy Town Podcast. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Don. I'm IT Explosive One. And let's crack into another one. Hells yeah. So TNT, Yo. I saw a, a thing online, and I, I don't know how true it is or whatever, but I guess somebody asked a question, and it was, my Japanese boss stopped giving me work suddenly. What does this mean? Does it mean he doesn't like me? And somebody responded, this is the old classic way to get someone in Japan to quit, sometimes called widows, window sitters. They come to work and are given no tasks, no assignments, attend no meetings, and so on. They are shunned by their coworkers. Eventually, they cannot stand being useless and quit. Thus, the company can continue to claim they have never fired anyone. If, if what would you do if you went to work and they didn't never and they never gave you any work and none of your coworkers talked to you or anything? Are you serious? I don't know. If, I didn't look it up past like seeing this online, so I didn't I dig into it to see if it's true. But I was like, "That's an interesting topic to talk about." Like, would I you would... just hang out and get paid, or would you eventually be like, "Yeah, oh, I'm gonna quit. yeah." I would hang out and get paid. I'd bring my switch in. Bring <laughs> just feet up on the desk yeah. playing Mario World, like yeah. just hanging. Oh, that sounds amazing. You guys want to keep me on this? Uh, yep, you done kept the wrong one on this payroll today. <laughs> you, you done quiet quit the wrong quiet quitter yeah. over here. Yeah. All right, it's a game of chicken. Guess what? <laughs> You're like, so I have to come in here every day for eight hours, but That's just weird. sit and do nothing. Yeah. Like, hmm. uh, okay, so look, I guess the the thing is that you still have to come to work. Right. I you mean, probably... you still, yeah, you, you can't just like not show up because then it's yeah. like job abandonment, right? Yeah. So. So you still have to come to work. You probably still have to, you know, you probably can't drink. You probably can't. Yeah, because, I mean, yeah, if you come to work drunk, they can fire. I mean, yeah, they yeah. can get rid of you because you're fired. You're essentially quitting. So I guess they just, what, expect you to sit in your office, your cubicle, whatever. And, bored every day. And just day. be bored. So I guess it's like the punishment kind of is in the uh, in the fact that it's just boring. It's like isolation. Like, uh, what do you call it? It's like that? solitary confinement. Yeah. Solitary work. Cause there's, cause like, yeah, like part of the thing about work is that it goes by fast cause you're doing things. But if you had to like just sit there and do nothing, I figure that I could do that though. I'd be bored. Yeah. But if like my job tomorrow, I went in and they were like, listen, we're going to keep you on the payroll, but we're not giving you anything to do. Period. Forever. <laughs> Oh, it'd be so great. Yeah. I would start, I mean, they'd probably be like, you have to come to the office too. That's how they get you. But I would. They'll make it so you have to come the to the only, office. I'm sitting in the office by myself. There's nobody else there because we're all sit virtual. At, at your desk looking at Reddit. I mean, I sit at my desk all the time anyway. So, yeah, dude, I don't know. I, I, I don't know how long I could keep it up because, like, I do, like, at times feel worthless. Not in my new job, but, like, the job I had before. Just like, man, I'm not doing a whole lot. I could be doing more. But I guess if, like, the point was, like, they stop – you you, like, email your boss. Like, you don't, they don't tell you. Like, you go in, you saw how many work, and you're like, hey, boss, I don't have any assignments or whatever. And they just don't – they ignore you. They don't respond. You email – like, you go to a coworker, and you're like, hey, do you have some work I can pick? But I haven't got any work. And they just, like, just Just pretend I'm right, not even there. Just walk right by you. I mean, look, man, if I check my direct deposit and it's in there, you got your I'm health, fine. You still got health insurance. You still get vacation. Oh, yeah. Still, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. They're like, what yeah. do you do for work? I sit. Yep, yep. Like, what do you mean? They're like, they stop giving me work, but I get to work there. Yep. I'd take, you know, take what if they're like? What if they, like, you couldn't have your phone at your desk, though? What if, like, you had to go in? But you had no work to do, and, and you had couldn't to stare at the freaking wall. Yeah, yeah, because like they could get you for like not being productive because you're just on your phone. Mofo, give me something to do. No, we are gonna play that game. <laughs> We're not gonna play that game because if you want to play that game, I'm gonna be like, all right, fine. Then give me some work. Oh, okay, I didn't think so. What are you gonna do? Fire me? Scroll, scroll, scroll. They don't want to fire anybody. That's the whole thing. They want to say they never fired anybody. All right, so don't fire me. But I'm going to be Come in my Come and phone. get drunk. Or you can give me some work to do. Or you can get the fuck out of my face. Those are choices. Would you Would you ever just start doing work of your own? Like you, you would just be like, listen, I got. I know I can work on. I'll make stuff better around here. And you just start working on your own stuff. Uh, I don't know. Like what? Like Figure out like some automated spreadsheets or like you got to like clean no, the windows or no, like reorganize like, the conference room or something. I, I don't believe in going above and beyond the call of duty when it comes to work. 
Right, um, ride it's... that line right right above uh, disciplinary action. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, lowest common denominator. Unless it comes to somebody's life, in which case, obviously, you got to right, 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 right. do what you yeah, got to do. Yeah, certain, certain jobs have things where it's like if you but, don't do your job, people can die or get hurt yeah, or whatever. I'm assuming that we're talking about uh, like salary men. Office jobs. Office jobs. Job. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm, I'm, yeah, I highly doubt it's like a doctor and they're just like, nope, we're not going to have to let you see any more patients. Yeah. <laughs> just like just stand around like, nurse, you need anyone help? And they're just like walk yeah, right by you. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. I don't think that's probably the jobs they're talking about. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, I guess, I don't know, dude. I figure it would... I don't know how long I keep it up, to be honest. Yeah, I like, mean, it would be tough. It would be so boring. It would be so boring. Like, I can't handle when my job is slow and it just, like, you just sit, like, you get in work, you get up to work, get yeah. up there, say, hang out, you gotta wait till 5 o'clock every day, and you're just staring at the wall. Just eight hours in a cubicle, looking nothing at paper to do. clips and And nothing to keep, keep you busy or, like, make, your, make you work a little bit, uh. like... It does sound awful, but I mean, but you'd be getting paid. How I guess here's the thing: like, how much how much do you make at the job, right? If it's a shitty job and you make yeah, like that's the thing, ten bucks an hour. Like, I could go find a job where I make more than ten bucks an hour. But if you're getting paid like say like sixty, seventy k a year, hmm? and you're just like, I'm not giving that up. Um, <laughs> <laughs> to do nothing. Yeah, I'm not giving. Like, that I'll up. write a book if I have to. I'll it's be like, oh, you want me to write? Okay, I'll just write. Yeah, I imagine that it is probably like an entry level position, and I could see it being a, like a useful tactic to some extent. But then I already know there's some people who just. Squat I know people on that. in my life that I've known that would they would do that in a second. Yeah, but I also know people who would be like, I'm not doing. It. I well, me, pro I would probably. I imagine after a while, I would give up. Because I just would be like, I'd rather just like do, I would feel useless. That's the thing. It makes you feel useless. You're just sitting there, dude. Yeah, you're getting paid, but you're not doing anything. But I'm getting paid. Yeah, but you're also in the office. I will find some books to study. I'll start going to college. <laughs> just do, yeah, just, just do classwork yeah, and stuff. Yeah. That's what I said. Like, write a book, write it. Like, do, do something you would never have done before, but you're like, well, I got all this time, so yeah. I guess I'm going to. Makes it look like I'm busy, right? You want me to look busy? Fine. Start typing up. Yeah, the, yeah, you're typing on a computer. You're just writing a book about Cinderella. You're writing Buffy the Vampire Slayer fan fiction. I don't like fiction. Well, I don't know. I do like fiction. I don't know. I don't like either one. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> you're like, I don't like words. Get out of here with words. I love words. I just don't like books. I guess. I like uh, I like nonfiction way better. Nonfiction. That's like true story stuff. True stories, informational, based, based like on a true story. Yeah, dude, because I don't I can't see things in my brain and I don't care about characters. So But there's characters in mystery. What do you think the, your favorite president is, George Washington? Do, do I you have, have a his rookie president? card? I, do I have a favorite president? Uh, I have his rookie Washington card. Rookie? The, got a GW rookie. I don't know if I like Yeah, I don't I don't even know if I care about history, folks. Who's your favorite? Uh... <laughs> New kid? Oh, Donnie. I don't know. Yeah, I was I was going to go there too. You don't have a favorite? Like, I don't have uh, a favorite. I don't have a favorite, favorite like singer. I don't. An artist? I don't. I you here's like, the thing. You okay. Like J Cole. Who? You like J Cole? I mean, he's all right. I've listened to like one of his albums. Like, what, what if J Cole hired you to be useless? What would you do? I'd be like, great. I don't know. I don't, I don't care about him. Do you like J. Cole Mac Miller? If Mac Miller, I like some of his music. Rose nope. from his tomb. I don't really Ooh, like people, man. Jonas, I want to hang out and smoke weed. I don't want. I don't want that. I don't like. I don't. Like, <laughs> I don't. You wouldn't smoke with the ghost of Mac Miller. Nope. I don't believe it. I don't even want to talk to him. You don't want to talk to nope. him. I don't care. What do you mean you don't care? I imagine I'd probably like him less if I talked to him. What does that mean? What if he just serenaded you? He just sang for you. I don't want that either. Would you you don't want him to sing his songs? He, they're his songs. Yeah, no, I don't think so. He made the songs. I don't think I would like that. You get to hear the man who made the songs make the sing the songs. I don't think I want to do that. What do you want to do with Mac Miller? Nothing. Nah, uh, you want to do something. Nope. What do you want to do? Nothing. Ooh, you to... want to do some weird stuff with it. <laughs> you want to do some weird stuff with it. <laughs> no, listen, okay. I've always had this problem my whole life. 
is like even when people are like, "Who's your hero? Who's whatever?" No, like, I, 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 I can't. I don't. I don't think I value anyone at nah. any higher level than yeah. anyone else. Yeah. So it's like yeah. whether you're Jeff, like, do I respect what like Elon Musk and Jeff Bezos have done? Yeah, I respect that they've made a lot of money. Do I care? No, no. They're just care. people like you and me, man. They're right? Just, they're yeah. Guys. Like I, if like, and that's what I guess is weird because like sometimes people will be like, oh my god, like at work, like oh my god, it's so and so. They're a this, and I'm like. What do you mean? What do you mean they're this? Like they're like a higher level employee. Like oh. they're, they're like a director or like a whatever, you know, like oh. a higher level. And I'm like, yeah, but they're just a person. They're just yeah. a person who got a job, dude. Like, Different circumstances, man. Yeah, I don't know. And some people, but some people are like, oh my God, I don't have to say because it's so, I'm like, what do you mean? They're just a person. Talk to them like a human being. Like That doesn't mean that you can't be like, yo, if I can meet this person and maybe talk to them about a time that they were integral in that directly impacted a part of my life. That doesn't I don't, mean I don't think anything like I really like, like think the last could, two albums that Mac Miller put out one right before he died and the other one post life. I don't have any questions to ask him about anything. Now, like, I couldn't think of one thing I'd like to ask him. about. And, and see, and I, I kind of feel I, I have the same issue where I don't really see anybody like that either. There's people I would like to meet, maybe talk to, and maybe just like ask them questions. I would like to talk to Jay Z just to be like, "Hey, can you give me some financial advice? What should I do? I have, you know, I have, I got <laughs> yeah. five thousand dollars. What should I do with it? How can I turn that into a million? Yeah, yep. I don't know, but I, yeah, we're we're a time. So that's all the time we have for today's episode. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe to thecrazytown.com. If you, who's your hero? Who do you want to talk to? Put it in the comments. For Jonas. Jonas, you're my hero. Oh, I appreciate that. We can talk anytime you want, friends. <laughs> we out.